Hey, what's going on guys? Rob from ClicksGeek.com. In today's video, we're going to go through adjusting your device bids for success. Again, if you are, you know, I say this every video, but it's so important. If you are a new subscriber, or I'm sorry, a new visitor, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Like, comment, share this video. We have lots of, um, lots of interaction in the comment section with um, our, our viewers. If you are looking for Google Ads training, check out the links in the description. We have lots of free training and stuff in those in those links. Also, if you are a business owner and you want us to run Google Ads for your business, you can apply to work with us in the description as well. That said, let's get right into it. It's going to be a quick video today. We're looking at a cash for junk car client, and we're going to look at adjusting device bids and how that works. So we're going to come into our campaign. We're going to come down to devices right here, <clears throat> and you're going to see... The last 30 days, March 28th to April 26th, 2022. And you have three different traffic types, right? You have mobile phones, you have computers, and you have tablets. So right off the bat, we have turned off traffic from desktop computers and tablets. Now we've done that because for this client in this market, they don't convert or they convert too high, right? So to do that, all you're gonna do is come to edit and increase or decrease your bid adjustment. So that's how you'll you'll use that as a lever to turn up that traffic or turn down that traffic. And as you can tell here, we turn that down. And we have our mobile phones are sending a, a majority of the leads here, which is 32 leads at $41 a lead, 40% conversion rate. So that's actually a little bit high. We wanna be under $40 for this market. So I would decrease this, start by 3% and see what that does over the next five days. Right, so you're going to use these as tools to increase and decrease your your best converting traffic. Obviously, if we're converting at 40%, we want more of this traffic versus if, let's say, computers was converting at 11% and the lead cost was way too high. If the lead cost is within range, that's fine. Leave it. Don't do anything. If the lead cost is way too high, you can either start decreasing it and try and see if you can get it under control, or you can just turn it off completely if it's just way out of control. It really depends on your unique situation, your market, everything like that. Now, to determine whether it's even worth increasing your bids, if you can even do it or you're just hitting the ceiling already and it's just going to waste more money, how we do that is impression shared top of the page. All this means is it's it, how many times your ad shows in one of the top four spots at the top of Google. Really simple metric. So you can see here 72% of the time on mobile phones, our ads are in one of the top four spots. On tablet, for it, well, the data we have here, it was 57%. So obviously, both these numbers are telling us we have runway to increase bids to attain more top impression share. So that's that's basically giving us a green light, like, okay, we can increase our bids more. Assuming you have to balance that, though, with your target cost per lead, because your cost per lead is going to go up if you're bidding more. So keep that in mind. So if this was down to like 30, $33, $34, and I was at 72%, I would increase this by 5 I would increase this by 5% and try and get more of those, more of that, that high converting traffic. And I would try and squeeze an extra conversion or two out of the campaign each week. So that's kind of how you're going to manage the uh, device bids. Really, really simple stuff. Just use the, use the numbers that give, you're given, right? You can do this on a weekly, biweekly, or a monthly basis. It's really up to you. We usually do this on a weekly basis because we have so much data. But um, obviously you need data to decide what levers to pull here, right? I mean, you can't base that off of 10 clicks. I would suggest you wait to at least have at least 50 clicks in the campaign before you start making any type of device bid adjustment. So that's it. Quick video, guys. That's all I got for you today. If you have any questions, drop them in the comment section below. If you want more Google Ads training, check out the links in the description. We have a free course in there and also paid courses and all kinds of different levels that you guys can go after. If you are a business owner, as I said before, you can apply to work with us in the description. And if it's a good fit, we can roll out a campaign for you as fast as 24 hours. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next video.